Hey guys, Spider 1979 here. Just make, gonna make a quick video showing guys the Cat-It Vesper Tunnel. So, here you go, this is from Cat-It. So, the Vesper Tunnel. So, this is a, like you can see in the picture, this is a tunnel that is only half the tunnel that you need to buy the two pieces. Uh, you can find them on sale. I did find them on sale for, uh, $20 about $20 $22 and as you guys can see my cat just love this thing so my cat is about 10 pounds and you guys can see the room that she has in there so I've put a little blanket down and I also have a uh, heating pad underneath that covers pretty much the entire floor so this is heated this is like a nice little tunnel and she just loves to play in it so i'm gonna tell you guys uh, just show you guys a quick review on this um, cat toy slash cat tunnel cat cat bed uh basically guys uh it comes with these two uh with a uh, little foam pad already but you know i wanted to make it a, li a little bit more cushy and comfortable so basically it comes with one with just half of it so uh, if you buy two of them you'll have two so i have these two plus the blanket so that is a nice and comfortable just padding there's there on there plus underneath all that i have my uh, heated uh heated pad so right there it's going underneath and it's heating the entire uh, shindig so uh, she just loves to play in this tunnel guys just love it uh, this tunnel is made from I don't know if you guys have winter coats or some material that is like uh, really really tough so uh, I have my jacket that is made from similar material than this and this isn't like uh, the other material from uh, this uh, power boot tunnel this power boot tunnel is made kind of like a parachute material but not quite and this thing is almost like Gore-Tex so this is a little bit tougher material that's not gonna rip and that's not gonna do anything that is one of the best part right there guys of this tunnel is the material that is built up built out of so made out of so this is a really really strong material that is gonna last you years so guys one thing i don't like about this uh, particular tunnel is first of all that you need you know two of them to complete the, the circle and the attachment method so the attachment method is just a little loop and a uh, little uh, piece of uh, plastic there so like a button on a, on a shirt or on a on jacket so uh, or a jeans uh, some jeans you know a button on the jeans so you basically just place that little bracket inside the loop there and this is how it's connected so uh, one thing I don't like is that it makes some ridges and uh you know i want it to be flush so that when my cat goes in she she doesn't have access out or you know she can stay in there and just stay uh comfy and just uh hidden so she if she likes to hide because otherwise you can see through those little cracks and at some point you know the, uh, sometimes she uh, puts her paw out and she she tries to play from outside it you, you can use it to play outside but I just wish it was closed you know with a zipper or something around that's pretty much one of the only complaints I have about this tunnel guys so you have uh, some toys incorporated in there so two little sponge ball so she doesn't really play with those but I leave it in there anyways but guys when she runs she starts to run and she goes through these tunnels i mean it's just she, <laughs> at some sometimes you know she just goes in in a certain direction and she's not supposed to go in that direction and she's just plowing through it and the tunnel is just like almost flying everywhere so uh <laughs> this is this is really fun to see and she really loves it uh she loved that one in the beginning and now this is one of her favorites so the round one so with the incorporated bed and the heating pad i mean this is a cat paradise guys so let me show you guys on the other side here so you guys can see the other entrance so you got two entrance that are connected so basically the only part that she can hide in is those little part there and you can see the um the little seam there so i've tried a couple of things to just try to make it but 
you know the only thing I can think about is just uh, using a zip tie or something to uh, to match them up and to make to make it that it's it's not but I don't want to pierce the material because there it's gonna start ripping and it's not gonna be good so uh, if I find another method at some point I'll just I'll just show you guys so there you go you see my cat she's just really comfy in there so she's just going back in there and just uh, <laughs> she's like can you let me sleep it's where i sleep during the day usually i bug you to go outside so yeah guys uh so the cadet vesper should you buy it guys it is definitely a good investment uh there are other ones out there and i probably will get some in the future to test out uh there's one from power roads uh i think uh you know that does have the zipper but i don't think the material is going to be as tough or the same so uh that's the only thing so i'll i'll try to get in the future if it comes on sale or if it's available on amazon.ca so uh, there's other manufacturers out there there's one with little bunny ears on the seams but this one is like really more expensive so this one cost me about 40 42 44 dollars uh depending on taxes and stuff like that from amazon but uh the other ones are like 60 or 80 bucks so 80 bucks for something like this when you can get it for 40 and the paw roads is also 40 dollars so uh guys it's just it's a no-brainer you know Th this you can buy just half of it or you could buy another one and just uh then use it for uh, you know place it on different places different corners uh but i like to do the donut because uh, that way she can run in from one corner and she's running around in there and you can play with her and stuff like that so uh you know really really good investment uh also this one the uh, little square and i did use one of her uh, uh transport uh, carriers so uh, to incorporate it, uh, it in there so made made a little toy like that so my entire living room is basically a cat playground <laughs> at that point so I have to, uh, you know, walk around these toys when, I, when I'm in there, but, you know, it's for a good cause, so uh, she loves it, and, you know, this is her space, and when she gets in there, uh, she just have fun, so, yeah, guys, so the Cadet Vesper Tunnel, so I'll put a link in the Amazon.ca uh, uh, page where you can get it, or you could just research it on uh, Amazon uh, US or whatever Amazon you're in. I am guessing they sell this in pretty much every country so really really great investment for a cat guys if you want to keep your cat entertained or just a place for them to sleep or just you know relax and you know have fun and all at the same time uh, this is a great investment guys so as you guys can see my cat is either in there all the time or she is in or her um, little uh, windows uh, hammock so this is something you use suction cup so little window hammock there so you just press that in on the window with su suction cups and I also put a little uh, just a little blanket in there just to make it a little bit more comfortable and easier to wash and just to maintain because all I have to do is wash the blanket uh, from time to time and that way uh, she's comfortable in there so all right guys so uh this was a little review on the cat at vesper so i'm gonna let my cat sleep now i'm just gonna watch some tv just relax and just let her rest a little bit so usually she's uh, jumping around and she's howling me to go outside but since there's snow outside right now she is gonna be a little bit more comfortable right there uh, on her heated pad so all right guys I'm just gonna give you guys a little close-up of my cat. Look at those eyes. Look at those green eyes. Isn't she beautiful? Yeah. I'm a cat daddy. All right, all right, you're camera shy. I get it, I get it. You don't wanna be a YouTube star, but you're gonna be one anyways. Haha. <laughs> all right, guys, if you did appreciate this video, thumbs up is always appreciated, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.